What is up, internet? Welcome back to another episode of The Last Campfire. Today, we will continue our playthrough. Question of the day is, what is your first memory? I think my first memory is waking up, climbing out of my crib, going downstairs, and my mom was making pancakes. I think blueberry pancakes? Yeah, that was my first memory. But I felt like it was very appropriate for this because uh, The Last Campfire is all about memories. People's memories that they, uh, they like go inside their brain and then do a puzzle. <laughs> but yeah, I've been, I've been enjoying this game. Second episode. It's a very cool game. And I uh, hope you're enjoying. If you're new here, drop a like. Subscribe to the channel for more uh, quality content. And yeah. Oh, wait a second. Lag. Okay. Okay, so last time we did the Fortress of Solitude or whatever <laughs> with Superman over there. Can we talk to this guy? Yeah. Curious. I'm headed for the crossroads. It's not far, I think. I've heard there's a nest there. A safe place. Loving this voice acting. It's so good. Alright, so we gotta go over here. And, uh... The pond. Yeah, this game is just so beautiful. Yesterday I went on a. Oh, here's the guy. Yesterday I went on a hike. It's great. Oh, we're gonna go into his brain. Mm. Nice. Yeah, so yesterday I went on a hike. It's so beautiful. With all the forests. A lot of pine trees, honestly. And some uh, some oak trees. Actually, you got an acorn. It's a very weird acorn. Am I gonna get blown off here? No. What does this do? Why would I want to turn this though? Why does it matter? Hmm. Sitting out there every day by the pond. Only the dark water to hear him talk. That's so sad. In that darkness, a glimmer flickered. What was the point of those blowing things? Oh, I got it. My thoughts beating like a drum. Oh, we're carrying the flame. Got it, got it, got it, got it. A thought that went round and round. Started with a frog. I couldn't hold on. Got it, got it. Now I get it. Alright, let's fix the one up there. Alright, we did. Okay. Yeah, this is pretty easy. <laughs> Honestly, I thought that was harder. This reminds me of that Breath of the Wild challenge. Sorry that I'm always referencing Breath of the Wild, it's just such an expansive game. So it just like, had a lot in it, content in it. But there was that annoying blue flame quest where you had to bring the torch without getting rained on, it was so annoying. It took me a while to do. But this is super easy. He's just like huddling, carrying a flame. Sometimes you gotta do that on like the Sabbath when you can't light a fire. Or um, on holidays, when you're not allowed to light a fire, but you're allowed to have fire on your stove, so you can like transfer the fire. So you gotta do that. That's cool. Now he's alive. Oh, Let's see what color this guy is. What's up with the leg? No, oh, he's just like brown. No fish on his head. For a brief moment, the fisherman struggled to speak. <laughs> yeah. He looked at Ember, hopeful. The fisherman spoke softly. There's a frog in that pond. A big one. Ali Dood. <laughs> saw him grow from a tadpole. We were friends of a sort. Spent every day side by side. That's nice. Tell me more. So much better at fishing than me, that frog is. No. Catches them before I can bait them. Lol. Oh, that makes me feel useless some days. Nature is better than humans. The fisherman sighed. 
I've wasted so much time feeling like this. Uh -huh. The old man looked carefully at the pond, at their rod, at Ember. Well, listen to me here, rambling on and on. It helps, though, telling someone. Thank you, Ember. Yeah, man. But if venting is is an amazing feeling. <laughs> Can I ask you to catch something? <laughs> About your mate. Let's see. Poor little worms. They didn't ask to be here. <laughs> but how do you fish without them? Mm. One for me, one for the fishes. Slurp them down. <laughs> Slurp them down. <laughs> Don't shoot. They say cat. So I tell myself. I tell myself that a lot. About the frog. You saw the frog? Did the frog mention me? You ask the frog about me. See what they say. Actually, no. Just please don't tell the frog how much I talk about them. <laughs> <laughs> about your hat. I chased old blue Betty round this pond for years. Oh, this is the name of the fish. That's funny. Best days of my life catching that fish. <laughs> Had to use myself as bait. <laughs> Stuck on me head ever since. Oh. <laughs> what? If you need help catching anything, you just ask. Alright, good to know, good to know. Thanks, man. Can I do anything here? Knock that over. Perfect. Now it's connected. Nice. Um. Alright, so now we're gonna redo. Hmm. Oh, perfect. Mr. Frog. The frog stared at Ember. It's belly oh, The frog is huge. Compared to the guy. I guess the guy was frozen for a long time. <laughs> Listen. Its eyes were fixed on Ember, but it seemed to mean no harm. Good froggy. <laughs> Is this the frog that the fisherman spoke of? Probably. Ember could hardly ignore the rumbling from the frog's belly. Ribbit. Ribbit. Okay, so that means he's hungry. So I should catch him a fish, no? We went here the last time, but there was nothing to do here. If I remember correctly, there was just this. And then it did something. Alright. We lowered that, now we want to raise it. Alright, so we should go to raise it. I love how it zooms in. It's like such a small detail, but it's really nice, honestly. Alright, so we want to raise that so we can cross over there. But how do we get to the other side? Oh, that's so cool. I touched the cobweb and then, bam. You ever, like, walk somewhere and then you get cobwebs in your face? The difference between cobwebs and spider webs is that spider webs actually have spiders in them, but cobwebs don't. So, shouldn't be afraid of cobwebs. And spiders are not that scary. Even though you're never more than, what is it, 10 feet away from a spider? Ah, so we gotta get over there somehow. See that ball and chain over there? Hmm. So it's probably like back. Gotta travel back. Yeah, you're really never more than like t 10 feet away from a spider. They're in your walls, they're outside, they're everywhere. If you have arachnophobia, I'm sorry. <laughs> But yeah, spiders are honestly really cool. I saw Coyote Peterson, like, hold a black widow. I mean, I wouldn't necessarily do that, but still. Oh, we got the peoples. A four, three out of seven. Perfect. Alright, so... Hmm. How do I get up there, then? Maybe I go over here. To the other side. Probably. Nice. Got an arch. The art sound in this game is like so distinct. It's very interesting. I downloaded a bunch of games because of the Black Friday sale. Um, the guys who made uh, Hades, if you played Hades, need a key. The old gate was locked. Yes. No, oh, I don't have a key. The crow held its shining trophy tight. Ah, the crow is the key. Okay, um. Talk to this dude. The stranger whispered, 
ever feel like you are being watched? Yeah, you get that feeling. Everybody gets that feeling, like that somebody's staring at you, like the back of your head. <laughs> Sometimes I would just do that in class, just like to my friends, if I wanted to talk to them, I'd just like stare at them for a second, and then they would like, you feel that like tingling, you know? You know what I'm talking about? I've never felt that. What does it feel like? Is it nice? It's kind of, it's kind of weird, honestly. It's not, it's not. I wouldn't call it nice, but I don't know. <laughs> Being watched. That's not, not the nicest thing, I guess. Some of these brambles. The cave entrance was overgrown with dry brambles. Ah, oh, so so usually when it comes to dry brambles, I can actually burn them, which is nice. So I need to find some sort of torch. See, can I carry the fire? I can. Oh, perfect. So what I could do here is actually burn this. Die. See. Now what did that do? Can I go up here? I can. Alright, what's up here? What is this? Inside was a scrap of journal. Oh, sick. The strangers on the water went on without me. Where have I landed? Vines and thorns stretch out to trip me. Oh, this guy went through the same thing as I did. <laughs> I lost my aura and now the strangers on the water went on without me. Hmm. Aha. Um, can I get to you? No. Alright. I love those cherry blossoms. Remember that scene from Kung Fu Panda where like Uwe dies and then he gets like enveloped in the cherry blossoms and it disappears? Such a cool scene. Such a cool scene. Beautiful music also. Love that movie. Time to feel the thunder. Yo, that's sick. Were there any brambles elsewhere? I'm trying to figure out. Die, cobwebs. Just a neat detail. Ooh, what is this? Oh, I just dropped the torch. That's cool. Oh, it's a person. Oh, okay. Challenge accepted. Hashtag Barney Stinson. A fragile flame. A stranger shivered in the cold. Uh huh. So what does this do? They'd moved through such dark places. Oh. I see what I gotta do now. Easy. Like the challenges are cool, and that that they in that they implement a lot of new stuff. But like, not that hard, honestly. The the other one is a little hard. I had to. Last episode, I had to try it a second time. Yeah, now I just go here. Oh, I gotta get an actual torch. Hmm. Let's see. Yeah, that's fine. So now I'm this fire. Bam. And now, light it. So light him up, up, up. That that was from. Is that from Big Hero Six? No, was it? I don't know. Immortals was from Big Hero Six, but they're both by Fallout Boy, right? Yeah. Great movie. Great movie. Also, uh, Marvel actually, I believe. I think it's Marvel. Yeah. They have comics and everything. I'm a huge Marvel fan, if y'all didn't know. I watched all the movies with my dad. Big Marvel fans. I would not... Yeah. A long time. <laughs> Gotta say. Alright, so we saved this person. Yeah, so I'm a huge Marvel fan. What is this? A net? Yeah. Really? Oh, bird. Yes. That's probably what I need for the bird. Alright, what do we got over here? Secrets? No? Nothing? Yeah, so I'm a huge Marvel fan and I went to pretty much all the movies with my dad. Where am I? Oh, cool. Oh, that's nice. It's a shortcut back here. Cool. Um... Yeah, a lot of them we would go to just a regular movie theater in Brooklyn, but 
like the big ones, like Infinity War. And I think Endgame, we also went. We went to Manhattan. We went to the giant AMC theater with a huge screen. It's like 80 feet tall. For those in, uh, in meters, I don't know, like, um, I don't know meters, I'm sorry. <laughs> Can I take out my net? How does that work? Um, L, R, minus, plus, controls guide. Um, oh, inventory is Y, okay. Why? No? Can I not use the net here? Hmm. Alright, why? I guess not. I guess I can't really, like, toggle the, my inventory. I can just see what's in it. I can't actually use them. Wait, can I just walk over here? Derp. Give me the key. Pressing buttons, it's not doing anything. Of course it's gonna fly away. Come back here. Where are you going? Oh, just drop the key in the... Oh, I need the fisherman. Okay, um... First let's go over there. And then we can tell the fisherman. Right? I would assume that's all we have to do. He said if we ever need him to fish stuff. Yeah. Oh, I guess I have to use that. <laughs> Swipe. One time I was by my friends in Pennsylvania. Oh, my net is broken. <laughs> so it didn't work. Um, but yeah, I was by my friends and we actually caught a bunch of frogs. We put them in a bucket and it was like, their house was like um, basically on a little lake. And so we put it on their porch and it was elevated. And then the, the morning after we checked and the bucket was empty. Maybe one of their parents emptied the bucket, but we thought they escaped. <laughs> Maybe jumped out. And we put like a thing on top. Like a, I don't know what we put. Maybe a paper plate? But I was like really good at catching them. Alright, now we got four out of seven. I wonder what, what happens when we get seven. Hmm. I don't know, I don't believe this is such a long game, but like... Alright, Mr. Fisherman. Help me out here. I need you to retrieve the key. The beautiful game. I need some help. Stop it. Get some help. Yep. Select. Let me have a look. See what I can do. The silk fed. The fisherman carefully knotted it together. Nice. With each knot he tied, a net began to form. Nice. <laughs> Here you go. So poetic. A net began to form. Wow. Hey, there we go. Alright, now let's go back there. Get that key. Open that door. Get whatever's there on that pedestal. I have no idea what it looked like. Kind of looked like a hammer. You ever use a gavel? It's pretty fun. <laughs> I gotta say. And yes, I've watched How I Met Your Mother, and Marshall becomes a judge, etc., etc. He gets to use a gavel, it's probably sick, yeah, I know. <laughs> They're so cute. Like, literally. They're so cute. Just like wearing pillow cases. That's what it looks like. <laughs> they, or they, just are, they just look like pillows, because they're, they're fluffy and they just run around. Like, look at Ember. Oh, I forgot, I can run. Run. Little feetsies. Yeah, let's do it. Yeah, yeah, I got it. Yeah, yeah. Select. Swipe. Here we go. Gate key. This is a funky looking key. I got these really funky looking keys where I live. I don't know if you can see this, but. Like, look at that. Crazy grooves and stuff. It's like, and they even have like moving parts in some of them. They're really, really funky. These ones are just one piece of metal, but the other ones sometimes have like a little magnetic thing. I don't even know. It's really complicated. 
So I don't want people breaking in. <laughs> the old gate was locked. Yeah, yeah, it was. Select. Ember placed the key in the lock and slowly began to turn it. Oh. I got it. Oh, there we go. Alright, what do we got in here? What is this? Oh, it's a person. Oh. Huh. Kind of looked like a hammer because it was to the side. It's trapped in this jail cell. So sad. <laughs> Submerged. Draining an ocean. Stranger gasped for breath. Dark water sleeping above their head. Oh my god, that's so sad. This guy probably drowned. Alright, what is this? Interesting. But if we take this off, it'll go up, right? Oh no, it won't. Okay. Okay, so it's once it's activated, it stays activated. That's nice. Alright, now lower this. Yeah, so I'm pretty sure I'm right. Where if she narrates more. Then, then I'm doing it right. <laughs> Look at the frogs. They're so cute. Put that down. The inky depths. I've honestly never been in the middle of the ocean. I've gone, um, what is it, parasailing? That was really fun. I did it with my mom. My, my sister did it with my dad. Whoa, 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 put it back. Put it back till it's fully activated. Yeah, and you're just like totally above the hotels. I did it in Cancun. It was really, really fun. Oh, okay, so this one I need to leave. Okay, that makes sense. Right, you stay there. Lag. Why lag? Stop lagging. It's not even like a super complicated game. Stop lagging. <laughs> there we go. And the cage just melts away. Such a cool animation. That platform looks like it has a smiley face if you saw. Like on the bottom, in the middle, it looks like two dots and a smile. <laughs> and now, the light has returned to this person. Oh, they're yellow. Nice. This one doesn't have uh, one of those corner tufts. Oh, it's a sick color palette. Like, that ombre though, it's on point. The stranger looked down. The ground feels good beneath my feet, friend. <laughs> it's like, yes, I'm alive. Nice. Okay, so, we did that. Now, what's next? We can go over here. Is there anything else over here? That is the question. I don't think so. Alright, I think that's it. Alright, Ember. Run your little socks off. I don't think you're wearing socks, but... Run, Forrest, run! Oh, cool. We have not been here. Oh, I thought those were toadstools for a second. puzzle. Finished in like two seconds. Alright, I can pick you up. Um, is that a worm? Or a snake? Hello, worm. Haha. <laughs> the worm looked helpless with no way to escape. There was no escape. As Ember picked it up, the worm let out a little yelp. Oh. I'm sorry, I need you. Probably to catch the the frog. That makes sense. Is there anything else to do here? Yes, there's something over here. What do we got over here? Anything? Shortcut. Nice. Wait, is there anything else? I wonder if there's any secrets in this game. Like, I haven't found anything. I don't know. Ooh, journal piece. Probably. There it is, yeah. 
Unfamiliar trees, a path overgrown. Is this a resting place? A place, a place between, between places? places? That's what the spirit said. I call out, but mine is the only voice. Maybe the spirit is this person that wrote these notes because they also said a place between places. Hmm, interesting. And they want to help people move on. Nice, nice, nice. Alright, so we want to go back to the fisherman to give him the worm and then um, and then probably catch the frog, I would assume. Yeah, now we have five. They're so cute. They're just like gathering up over here. Go sit. <laughs> it's a nice campfire. Get warm. Alright, fisherman, I got you a worm. What you got for me? I wish the music was a little bit more pronounced. Goodbye. If you need help catching anything, you just ask. Oh, I probably just give it to the frog. They're, he was hungry, right, right. Yeah. I don't need the fisherman to catch it. The frog's right there. I also love frogs. There are some frogs. They're like, the they're called um, glass frogs, and you could actually see their insides. It's totally crazy. That's what um, uh, Polly Polly Pollywag is based on. Pollywag is based on these uh, show item. Yeah, Pollywag is based on these tadpoles that have their belly is like see through. So, bam! Oh no, he ate me! What the heck? Shoot. This is not how I imagined the end. <laughs> not how I imagined the end either. Oh god. Spit me out, please. Ah, he spits me out on the other side of the cave. Hey, there we go. Cool. Nice. Forlorn. There we go. This is the sixth one. He looks so sad. Oh, more of these rolling stones. Unhindered. Okay. The stranger stood alone. Oh, I can push it this way. Their friends have fallen aside. Retreating from what came next. Hmm. The stranger had ventured on. Can I move this? No, I can't. Now they were deep in the woods. It felt so pointless. I can push this one all the way here and then get like a path. Nice. And now I can go around. Perfect. Unblock that stairwell. Easy. And the cage unenvelops. I don't even know if that's a word, but that's that's what I'm describing. <laughs> Give me the light. I think it was freshman year. We sang a song. It was. Shower the people with love. Shower the people you know with love. Show them the way that you feel. The stranger spoke hesitantly. It's sh no, it was shower the people with love. With love, show them the way that they fear. I'll see you there. Nice. I like this one's color also. It's pretty cool. All right, do we go? I guess we go this way. Uh huh. How do we get out of here? Wait, how do we get out of here? Shoot. 
Um, oh, right here. There. We got another journal piece. And found the wondrous diary. Yes. Why are they leaving it sporadically all over? They know more than they what? will say. They watch me watching them. They watch me. <laughs> the frogs are watching me. Oh god. <laughs> frog smell oily? Uh -uh. Never smelled a frog before. Last year when I went on a hiking trip with uh, school. Oh, I can talk to this guy. The stranger spoke. You look hungry, friend. You bring any broth with you? No. There's a cook in the swamp. Makes a broth like you wouldn't believe. Did I meet the cook? I don't think so. Keep telling them that it doesn't taste right. They'll keep giving you more. <laughs> That's funny. Checkpoint. Kind of, I guess. Hmm. Yeah, I think we gotta go back to the campfire. Um, I don't know where the seventh person is. Is there anywhere where we didn't go? This is a question. Right, let's ask the spirit. Have we? Sh should have we been speaking with the ghost the whole time? Mm. Help me. Step backwards, little Emma. Look behind. Upon a small grassy cliff rests a forlorn. Mm -hmm. Step backwards. Um, I would assume that means this, maybe. I don't know. This is where we were before, though. Right? Honestly, don't remember. I played this game for episode one, uh, like last week. So, <laughs> here's the grassy cliff. Um, yeah, this is where we were in the beginning, right? Oh, that's so cool! I could go in the bush. Run, forest, run! I'm getting lost, aren't I? Hmm. Fox. Foxes howled into the night. The only reply was silence. Yeah, we were here. If I didn't get any new items that could potentially help me, I don't know. I must have to like bring a torch somewhere. Hmm. Hmm. Puzzling puzzles. Why is the bar called puzzles? That's the puzzle. <laughs> Such a stupid concept. You ask me. Honestly, I want to take um a bartending course. Probably like in the next couple of years. Like after I finish army and whatever. Yeah, because I, I do like mixed drinks. Even though I have a sensitive stomach. Oh, that that was the forlorn. The guy on the cliff. Oh, I just saw him. Okay, so... Can I go this way? No. Can I go this way? Have you met Ted? Why am I doing this again? Can I go anywhere? Can't go here. This is where I got the worm. Yeah, I don't know how to get to that guy. He's on the cliff. But like, hmm. Give me a torch. Why not? I'll take it. Torch. This. Yeah, see, he's right. He was right here. Like, on this cliff. I don't know how to get to him. No, pick up the torch. Can I pick up the torch? No, I lost it. Okay. Um. Hmm. 
Not very helpful. Can I go here? Where does this go? Nope. Probably cut to where I find them, but really don't know where I'm going. Oh, there's the forlorn. Oh, it's right there. Hmm, how do I get to that? Hmm, yeah, one more. It's not that alive guy, it's another forlorn, the, the frozen in stone people. So, it's probably this way? Yeah, there we go. Perfect. Alright, that was, that was pretty easy. God, just look around. Forest campfire. All right, we're back over here, but over here. Talk to this guy. You ever had roast frog, friend? No, but supposedly frog legs in France is a delicacy. I miss a good roast frog. Oh, how they crackle. I mean, it's very, very soft frogs. So, like, I guess, I don't know. Kind of sounds gross. They're pretty slimy, so I wouldn't really want to eat that. Not kosher either. <laughs> We only eat animals that are like docile and we ba we basically eat animals based on their uh, based on their personality. Like we don't eat animals that eat other animals. We eat only nice animals that are nice to others. The stranger has been forgotten. Try to follow as best they could. But no one heard them when they fell behind. thinking how to do this. That was easy. <laughs> Bridge. Elevated. Spirit. Attained. That wasn't so hard, but cool. Now I got 7 out of 7. Now, is there more to this game? Or is that it? Because if that's it, it's kind of, kind of a short game, but I don't know. We'll see. Found all the forlorn. Did all the puzzles. I don't know if it's all of them, but here you go, boy. Now you have awakened. You are now purple. And. No, I thought it was green for a sec, but. Nope, just purple. You have awakened, my friend. Hello. I am Baymax, your personal healthcare assistant. Someone came back for me. Thank you. You are very welcome. Now join me by the campfire. Come around the campfire, sing the campfire song. Sing a fire as an orangey song. I honestly never watched SpongeBob as a kid because my dad said it was brain rot. So, all you in the comments might roast me, but never really watched SpongeBob. I mean, obviously I've seen episodes and whatnot, but like, never really watched watch SpongeBob. Supposedly they made him gay. Yeah, that was interesting, <laughs> to say the least. My friend told me the other day, Patrick is so stupid because he literally lives under a rock, which I never honestly get. God, but you yeah. Have done all you can, little one. Your journey lies ahead. Well, yes, it does. Little one, your journey ahead will not be easy. The path to leave this place is blocked. Yeah, there's some evil presence, right? The person. I will guide others to follow after you clear the way. Oh look, they're all roasting frogs. That's so cute. <laughs> From the campfire. How are you roasting a frog from that far away, though? Open. Open sesame. Oh, it's so cool. It has the face on top. 
Oh, sick animations right here. Like me, who can help. Nice. You will always be welcome here in the forest. Oh, I right, thank you. So I think this is like stage one, like world one, I guess. There are seven people. Right now, yeah, it's got to be more in this game. That was way too short. Once again, Ember could feel eyes watching. Ooh, new people. What is this? Another forlorn. Ember approached the forlorn. It felt it was different. Yeah, looks different. A little darker. They said, I know what I need to do. But I need to feel. So this, this game is like so deep. Oh my god. I, just, I don't want to be hurt. So why? Ember could not help. Not all problems were puzzles to be solved. Double on Tanya right there. Okay, do you want to go up here? I, I guess. I guess so, but I, I wanted to go to the right, or to the left, this way, that way. My right, your left. The crossroad. Alright, so actually let's go back. I want to go to the, that way, to see where that guy went. Maybe there's somebody there. Hmm, very cool though. <laughs> Alright, so let's just see, actually you know what, I think I'll save here, and we'll do that in the next episode. So, hope you enjoyed this video, please like, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!